Soldiers! Infantry! Attack! That's cool. Call horse archers infantry. That's fine. Nothing confusing about that game. Come on, where are they? Where the fuck are they? There they are. Have they not caught on yet that I'm right here? Okay, there we go. That that was the moment. <laughs> that was pretty beautiful. All right. I want a perk. And I'm going to get it through getting one-handed skill. By cleaving through motherfuckers with my hilarious fuck-off sword. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Get out of there. Get out of there. See, this is why I don't like fighting in rough terrain, everybody. It's not good for when you're on a horse. We're good, we're good. That was almost bad. Come on. I gotta lead my shots just a little better. There we go! Gun rig is at 136 bow skill now, nice. I'm sorry, did I get hit by a stray rock at the end of there? What happened? Okay. Got a point in tactics for once, that's rare. I do like the Hitman vision in this game. Yeah, they do a good job of making it useful, but not bullshit. It just helps you get, get an overview of what's going on in a big battle, you know? How's our food variety, by the way? I haven't been paying close enough attention to my morale. Food variety's good. Uh, I wish it was a little higher. Oh, did we actually let two people live there? That was a mistake. But I probably can't catch them now, now that it's such a small group. I hate having to go through this forest over and over. We need a better scout than this. Like, our scout's good, but what's the skill? 82? It's good. It's just good. It needs to be better. What's the cap on that? He's at his cap. Next level up we get, he absolutely needs scouting. He's our scout. It's why we have him. Oh, hey, let's meet up with that guy because he can get us progress towards our main quest. Uh, Huruneg. Tegret. Tigret. Uh, Epic Clans of the Steps, yep. Yeah. The Lord of Akalet. 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 You get text from auto battling or using commands. Yes, that is true. Auto battle is actually fairly safe in this game, believe it or not. You get a lot of wounded, but you don't get a lot of dead. And a lot of wounded actually gets you opportunities to get your medic skill up. But our medic is pretty much at our cap right now, so we don't really need to farm that. We do need to farm tactics, though, because tactics is one of the best skills in the long run. At least it seems like it. I was there. Many of the... Okay, I gotta learn how to pronounce this. I gotta learn how to pronounce all the kingdoms, because it's hard as fuck, you know? Kazates? Kaz... Zates. I want to say it's Kazates, but I'm not sure. It's worth pointing out that I'm pronouncing all of this in how you would in English, and I'm sure it's supposed to be pronounced in some kind of, like, old Turkish, steppe Asian language, you know? Because these tribes are supposed to be based off, what, the Uyghurs? The Uyghurs would have been one of the tribes that came down and became the Turks. Judging by the time period this is based on, it's these guys are probably supposed to be Uyghurs, but I'm not sure. Not 100% sure on that. The Britannians, which is still hard to say because I want to say Britannians because they're clearly Celts. Uh, yeah, I'd planned an ambush up the word wooded pass for the Imperial Vanguard. We had heard about that, yeah, that it was the Britannian uh, ambush that killed the Emperor. Then the... Uh, Vlandians, Vlandians, I gotta get used to that, which is like the, the Nords. And no, the Sturgians are the Nords. The Vlandians are the ones in the far west that are like the French, 
I think they're supposed to vaguely be French. Uh, but I could be wrong. Sweeping down their flanks in battle, our scouts found the Batanians' ambush. Beat the uh, Nederet. Neretez did not listen and blundered into it anyway, yeah. But Neretez didn't listen. That was the emperor who was killed, wasn't it? He was the emperor of the kind of Rome. Yeah, ne Wells' vanguard was being slaughtered. Uh, the Vlandians. Still don't know if I'm getting this right. Uh, Vlandians bought, bought lots of crossbowmen. Yeah, brought lots of crossbowmen. And our horse archers took heavy losses. Eventually, the armored Imperial Cataphract showed up and rolled over the crossbows. Which is the heaviest in the game, I think. You don't read the H. It's Ku. Give me a full sentence, please. Because I don't know... You don't read the H in what. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Kuzate for sure. How do you know for sure? Is there like somewhere in the game where they say it out loud? And are you saying that this country is, is named Kuzate? K-H-E-R-G-I-T-S is Kuzate. Because that, that's some bullshit right there. <laughs> it's q -Zate. Really? Man, that language does not translate, does it? Alright, let's keep moving. Yeah, raiders, looters, run in fear. Not that is Kurgitz. This is this is precisely why I ask people to use full sentences. If you're not using a full sentence, you are giving me useless information. <laughs> because you're usually responding to something like 15 seconds late because Twitch is bad about delay. This is why I always ask for full sentences, guys. It's real confusing. When I have 200 people telling me things that are answering the wrong questions. <laughs> okay, hold on. Who's this guy? Devious. Don't want him. The country is Kazates. And the... Kergets are a family within it uh, that would later become the leaders in Warband. Thank you. That's what I was looking for. Because I know that these this is supposed to take place in the world of Warband just 200 years prior. And that this country became the Kergets. I know that. Just like how the... Uh, what was the name of this country up here again? This country. Sturgia. The St Sturgia became... Um, the Nords. The H is silent and in Kurgitz. Well, well, yeah, because it's K-H. I've never pronounced the H in that. What's the meaning of full sentences? When you're responding to a question on a stream, use a full sentence. It makes these, it makes it as easy as possible for the streamer to understand what you're responding to. Okay, we got 25 stewardship. Beautiful. I'm taking supreme authority plus one influence if ruler. In the long run, that is really going to pay off for me. And do we have any more things on anyone else? Not looking like it, no. And quest is pinging because we got to 50 renown? Got to 50 renown. Okay. Okay. Now that we're here, we need to talk to this person, who is a gang leader. <laughs> Why is always the best characters are cruel or devious or something bad? I know, right? Sturgia is proto uh, Vager, actually. Interesting. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, who be? Well, who becomes the Nords then? Uh, were you not the person I had to meet up with for the quest? Why'd it do that again? It keeps bringing up my steam overlay. That's so weird. I have the sheep, don't I? I have the six sheep, yeah. What's going on? 
Was it not that person? Oh, two people are called Snake Eyes. How confusing is that? Is this the other one? Yeah. There's two people called Snake Eyes in the same town. Here you go. I only got 650 bucks off that. Gained a little charm. And I pissed off an entire faction. That's why I say these things aren't worth it. Yeah, I remember that. There was once a community manager. It, actually, I don't think it was even a community manager. I think it was literally the dev of Felseal Arbiter's Mark, which is a great game. Came into the chat once. And he had this special way of writing. Yeah, he put the topic of the sentence at the start. And I said, like, that was the most useful way anyone I have ever seen in my over a decade of streaming. I've been streaming since before Twitch. I have never seen a guy write in a more helpful way than that guy. Where every message he sent, the first two words was a subject line. And then, like, a dash, and then his message. And it made it so easy to understand what he was talking about. It was so smart. I don't know how he came up with that. How the hell did he came up with come up with that? And I've never seen anyone else do it. Like, oh, it was so clever. That guy was a genius. I wish I could remember his name. He was really fun. People have found the Nords in the files, but they've yet to have been added. Okay. So they were probably like a minor nation that made their own nation after landing here. Got it. Okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm trying to make money right now. I have a little bit. I'm not going to get it off that. I... Oh, God, that oil is just weighing me down. What a waste. Don't have a good price on hardwood. Damn. I'm happy you're able to catch this stream. It'll be a fun. I'm not saying write long sentences, I'm just saying use a full sentence if you're answering a question, because it makes it easier to read. Alright, I'm gonna wait here. Because it's almost night anyway, and I need to heal. Okay, we've got the money, all we need is the party size to uh, finish that quest. I'll hire all these guys. Because they can all get on horses fairly early. I just want to hire a few more horseback dudes. We need one more to finish that one quest. Those cities look like, like they were raided. Did this one just get raided by that guy? No, good. Here we go. Gained 25 renown for finishing the quest, and something else happened there that went by way too fast to read. Is there a log for that? Yeah, if there is, I don't remember where. Okay, we finished that quest, though, which means we are officially clan tier 1 now. Next tier is at 150 renown. We can now have four companions rather than three. Uh, okay, so at clan tier 2, or uh, clan tier bonus, is that for current or next? I think it's I think it's current. So we can have an extra uh, clan party plus one, companion limit plus one, party size for every party in the clan plus fifteen, and we are eligible to be a vassal now. And when we double our renown, we'll we'll be at clan tier two. Okay, got it. It's essentially how famous we are, what our clan tier is, how famous is our banner, how no how royal are we, you know? How much weight does our name hold? Mm, family feud. Landlord needs access to the commons? I don't know what this quest is. Helping to dispute nearby. Uh, that sounds like it'll piss someone off. Offers to pay blood money for the crime, but he wants revenge. I think this ends in a fight. I bet you we could actually do it now. I'm willing to try. This one isn't a criminal act, so I'm willing to try it. We've failed this quest before, though. Yeah, we already know what this is all about. I'll protect your relative. He's willing to pay 500 dinars. We'll see if we can do it. 
Okay. It was wait here until night first, right? Something like that. Wasn't it L for log? No. J for quest. God, that's confusing. We have five days. We need to talk to him in this town first, then convince him to go talk. Yeah. So he'll be on the outskirts of this town, so I need to go talk to him. Why don't you give the game away? I, I don't understand why, where this idea is coming from. I, I can't... I can't give... I'm playing it. <laughs> like, it's attached to my Steam account. What are you talking about? Yeah, I'll talk to them right away. Okay, so it's that guy. Family feud quest can be resolved without fighting, but you need to choose the right answer before you... Uh, to win the Persuasion minigame. Okay. I don't know if I have high enough charm skill to do that. Giveaway for the game. On your stream. Uh, you're gonna have to give me a full sentence on what you want me to do. I'm sorry. They want you to raffle off a game key. I don't have a game key. Why is there an assumption that I have a game key? I'm really- I'm lost. Did I say something that got misinterpreted? Huh. Anyway, uh, yeah, 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 I know your thing. Yeah, that- you're the one who wants me to get you to have the land. Yeah, you're not the guy I'm looking for. Who is the guy I'm looking for? Where the fuck is this guy? It's Dachin, right? Why does he not have a quest marker over his head? Hey, I'm just translating. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not saying it's weird that you're saying I- I don't understand the request. Why is there an assumption I have a spare game key? It's not, like I, it's not like I know the developers or something. I've never talked to them in my life. Huh. Probably the idea behind gifting it would be to get more viewers. Who cares how many viewers I have? We're all just having a fun time. Alright, alright. This guy better fucking not get murdered, I swear to god. If he gets murdered, I'm blaming him, not me. All right, how's this go? I am going to this village. Okay, it's not that far. I'll stop off at this city on my way. Okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? You know what? That price looks good. Oh my god, finally! I wish I didn't sell that oil before. I could have made such a profit. God damn it. Fuck. Alright, whatever. We made a money. We finally made a profit on the oil. And we didn't even get any experience for it. Why? Man. Did you do a warrior or a Rochi 4 walkthrough? No? I don't know what that is. Sorry. I think I've heard the name? Huh. You watched the Empire's 8 playthrough. Oh, um, Dynasty Warrior Empire 8? That was fun. Fun, but a bit easy. If you want to boost your trade skill, there's a glitch in the game. I'm not exploiting shit. That's not fun. I'm not even reading it. Not reading it. I don't want any temptation from that shit. I want to play a fun game, not cheat my way through. I don't find cheating fun. Cheating takes all the fun out of it for me. That's just how I am. Okay. We have good money for once, which is really nice. I doubt MDB is famous enough to do giveaways on one of the streams. I did a giveaway a few times before, and that was before I blew up. That was like with 20,000 subscribers. I did some giveaways, but it's because indie devs gave me keys and told me, hey, do a giveaway. And so I was like, yeah, sure, why not? If I had spare keys, I'd give them to you guys, but I I don't, you know? <laughs> 